Hello everyone, and welcome back to Meyer Studio Sketch Club. My name is Izzy, next to me is my dad Jason, and just behind us is my mom Cindy. Tonight we will be doing four five minute sketches focusing on the head, neck, and shoulder gesture. Just the gesture of the head, neck, and shoulder. The, that. <laughs> tonight. Before we get started, my dad will actually tonight my dad will be working on the iPad for the introduction and sketch club. I'm done. Your turn. <laughs> Hello everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So I was a little busy recording videos right up until Sketch Club. So we're gonna run Sketch Club from the iPad tonight. And this week is our head, neck, and shoulder week. And we're going to focus on getting the structure and the connections of those three pieces. So what I'm going to do for the intro is uh, just quickly walk through my approach. And then on the sketching, I'm just going to go ahead and sketch and show you how I'd solve these. So what does this call for? Is he some iPad action? All right, there we are. Some iPad action. Ask and you shall receive. Then what would happen if we move this down to there and we press that eyeball right there? Boom. We have our first gesture. Yay. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is before we even see the volumes of the head, neck, and shoulder, think about what's happening overall. Okay, so we're going to... Do you guys get this sort of feeling? I think so, right? Who doesn't like a good feeling like that? All right. So let's come up. And then within that, what I can do is I can go, okay, her head is tilted and about like that. There's the top of her head. She's looking down. And let's see. Nope, that messed up. That was over there. So I just moved those parentheses over a little. You guys see how I can how easy that is to do that? And that's I want you guys thinking of this very simply. Right? So there, and then the stretch is on that side. And let's bring that stretch. So that's the pit of the neck. And then from pit of the neck, where's the shoulder? Is the shoulder up or down? And does it come where? About to the mouth? You see how I'm finding all of that? And then where does it come in? It comes in about the bottom of the nose, about like that. And then on the other side, where is that shoulder? Okay, does that make sense to everybody? So her shoulders are leaning down in this one, right? We're seeing lots of her forehead, but we're also seeing a, quite a bit of the top of her head. And then we're seeing quite a bit of this side. So it's going to be something like that. Uh, okay, so that's what we're going to see. Uh, what? I have a question not to throw you off or anything, but usually don't you work on the actual photo before you start? And the gray background was for the sketching. Well, yes, but this is going to be, this is what I'm going to show them mm. that we're doing. Okay. Right? Cool. Just so making sure. Just interpreting. Thank you for questioning my presentation skills, though. I, I appreciate that. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Izzy's a good sport. Izzy's a good sport. I was trying to make sure that if you needed to show something on the other thing, or why did you load the other thing up? So... You're, Pardon me. You're on top of it. I will try not to be helpful next time. You're on top of it. What do you guys see here for this? And as always, you can find these on our website, jasonmeyer.com, under reference images, under the sketch club, and then under reference images. So this isn't quite as exact, but we've got something like that, don't we? We see the head again is closer to this side. And this shoulder's further away. Okay, are we seeing one side of his face more than the other? A little bit, right? We see a little bit more of this side, don't we? And then this side, it's got just a touch of shadow. Just a, how can you tell, Jason? How can you tell? 
Well, which ear? How do you see the ears? Look for the ear. Do you see how we see a lot more of the one than we do the other? <laughs> Izzy sees it. No, Claudia was telling me I did a good job of telling you what's what. So you, you did a good job of telling me what's what, mm -hmm. and Claudia is encouraging this. Mm -hmm. I think her tuition just went up. I think <laughs> she just increased her tuition. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oof. Oh, the forces I work against. And I think she just increased how much I like her. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it doesn't take much for you. Hey. It doesn't take much for you. It does. <laughs> I have to actually like you without completely judging you first, which I do. So, you gotta... I got that going for me? Yeah. That's good. Okay, and then where does the shoulder in comparison to the chin... Right? If you can find that, that'll that'll be very helpful. We want to kind of locate, and then that other shoulder, is it higher, is it lower? You know what, it's higher, isn't it? Oof, did you realize that? That's a higher shoulder? Mm -hmm. Did you realize in all those years of his life that that shoulder was higher? Nope. He's been walking around with a higher shoulder all this time. How do you think that guy feels? Weird. Snail. Oof. What? A snail, you made a snail. I made a snail. You sculpted a snail during drawing class. I could never have been prouder. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, so do you guys see how this is happening here? So this is what you'll see when we start sketching, but I want to show you those these big forms. So just in case you can't see it, we get the egg of the head. We got the light coming this way. Here's the corner between the front of the face and the side of the face and then you've got the shadow over here and yes he has a beard but he still has a neck that's connected so there's the cast shadow the form shadow and cast shadow over here what if boys are insecure about their necks and that's why they grow beards that's the only reason we grow beards yeah. is our neck shame <laughs> is the neck shame how are we doing on time Am I going a little bit over? It is 7.07 .07 and you've done two people. Speed it up. Alright. Well this is a little bit slower. So again, what's our big shape here? You got a big shape here? Something like this. Maybe a little bit more like that. Over here. We've got the head. The chin. The top of the head. The shadows on this side. The stretches on this side. Where is the pit of the neck to the, well, it's over here, right? The nose is here. So he's turning, so this stretch is gonna come like that. And that shoulder, not very far, is it? And then this shoulder, that's like a Fonzie shoulder over here. Hey, hey. Claudia said it's worth her tuition going up. <laughs> <laughs> of course she did. Of course she did. All right. Yo, you're good, Claudia. For right now, anyway, anybody on Izzy's side is also on my side. Okay. So do you guys see how those gestures get made? And then the idea is once you kind of get a handle on this, can you be a little more, a little more what? Simplified? Oops, that was wrong, wasn't it? Yep. So something like that. Can show his nose. Maybe eye bridge. Right, so we could show his body going down like that. When you made the little eye line, it made him look like Prozone from The Incredibles. Prozone from The Incredibles. Let's take the other one away. So you see all that information is there and that's what I want you guys to get to to where you can abbreviate very quickly and accurately. Now accurate's not scientifically or mathematically accurate, but it's accurate representation of the big forms. All right, one more before we sketch. All right, I've worn myself out. Oh my goodness, and I still got to sketch. 710. So I hope you guys are ready. Let's see. Here we go. So what do we have this when you see one side? 
seeing a theme here and the other the shoulder sticking out further on the other side where's the nose here where are we pretty straight on that one we're relatively straight on and then her neck is a little bit over here Is that right? Or it actually stretched the other way, wouldn't it? So it's funny, these simple things are not so simple. Would we stretch that way? Because she's pinching back towards us. Okay. All right, so that is what I'm going to be building my sketches on. Let's see, enough of that. Way too much of that, actually. Ooh, I do look good. Oh, that shampoo's working out for me. <laughs> All right, back to my old self. Back to my old self. I know, it must be hard. Ah, uh, the joys of being me. Mm -hmm. The joys of being me. All right, so I'm going to start on top of the photo in my sketches when you're watching. But then I'm quickly going to take that photo away. But I just want to show you what my general um, thoughts are. But the reference will stay on the screen. Is everybody ready? Beyond mm -hmm. ready? Wait a minute. Where is our timer? Um, is it over there? Right here. Oh, we got it. Right? We only got five minutes for these things. Five minutes. So we got our timer. Let's do a little intro. And I'm going to press start. Let's get Woohoo. You know, no matter how many times I press these before to make sure they're working, during the show they just want to really take their time. You know, make sure the audience is ready for them. Okay, so we're on the iPad here. Let's come down here. Let's get Izzy up. And are we ready? So in five minutes, we're going to do this. So I'll, I'll talk a little bit, but again, I'm going to try to work pretty fast here. So let's get set up. Get the red so you can see that. We've got our layers opened up. Okay, here we go. Five minutes. Bam. So it, as I said, well, we want to see that. Then if you can capture this, give us that information. We see the pit of the neck is over here. So we come around, all right, this first shoulder coming out and this other shoulder Be going down like that. What does that give us? Right. So something like that, right? It almost looks wrong, doesn't it? Why is my head so big? Well, because it's got a light and a shadow that's not being properly displayed. So okay, that leaves me with three minutes to go. So what can we do, Izzy? Can we can we fix your big head in three minutes? Hey. Is that enough time? Well, you're the one that said it was a big old head, not I, me. I said you drew it like a big old head. Oh. I got a big old head. I could have swore you said I got a big old head. Mm. And I said, oh, it's just a drawing. Can you just sketch, chill a little bit? I, I have been sketch. told to help narrate, so I must put my attention upon that. <laughs> <laughs> you are brutal. You are brutal. <laughs> That's not a compliment. Thank you. Thank you mm. very much. Okay. So here we're going to go here. The hair. But what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm losing focus. See, I'm already tired. So what do we have here? Let's get rid of all that. Let's get rid of all that. All right. What are we going to do? We're going to say this is shadow. We're going to say this is shadow. We're going to say this is casting shadow. All right, form shadow. And then that shadow is going to be running off of there. Okay, 
so that's number four. Number three. Value. So when I say number four, I mean a dark value. When I say number three, I mean a gray value that's lighter than our dark value. When I say number two, I'm talking about the light. In this case, it would be the light on the skin tone versus the shadow on the skin tone. So there, then if we do number two. Okay, so number two going to be this form. And we got a little bit of your neck down like that. Whatever brush you're like using, it's reminding me of a whiteboard marker cuz when you go over a whiteboard marker twice, it starts to smear out the other one. Oh. <laughs> yep, it's similar to that. And then the highlights, where would the highlights go on here? And now this is kind of funky, isn't it? Because it looks like the highlight's over here. Kind of, doesn't it? But we can't do that. Why? Because we're turning around in the shadow. The highlight has to be over there. Okay? So says the book of Jason. It's not, it doesn't come from me. That, it, that comes from... That comes from just form and making things look a certain way. The forbidden rules. Forbidden rules. One Are minute you even the forbidden rule thing? Yeah. One minute doesn't scare me. I'm not scared of no one minute. Okay. Don't be trying to freak me out. <laughs> it's gonna take more than one minute to freak me out. Um. Okay. You more thinking like about it? Ten seconds. Freak you out. <laughs> Why do you want to see me freaked out? That's not nice. I know. Okay, again, this is the basis for what's happening here. This is what the eyes will go on top of, the nose will go on top of. All of that jazz. I'm proud of you. You just do the Broadway thing in your show. Thank you. You want my show to be on Broadway? I don't think this is a Broadway type of show. No, I'm saying the reference. Broadway. I just don't think it would work on Broadway. I'm not I appreciate the compliment it would be though. Thank in you. Your it's like one of the nicest things you've ever said to me. <laughs> while I'm drawing, people, while I'm drawing. And it's her. Anyway. Oof. Aren't you pretty? Beautiful. Or is this gonna put we put <laughs> that we can put that in your wed wedding album. Yeah. Alright. So again, I'm not going towards beauty right now this week. I'm going for understanding, right? We'd like you guys to understand what is happening. You got Logan up there? All right. Yeah, move us down a little. Give Logan some room. I did that all on my own. I'm so proud of you. you start the timer. <clears throat> Whew. You're ready for military school, but you're not going to get to be a drill sergeant when you go in. So you gotta earn that, yo. Mm -hmm. So back up that bus a little. Nope. Okay, what do we have? Do we see the center of the face pointing down to the chin? Right, and then the top of the head, the hairs up here. It's gonna line up. Then where do we have the pit of the neck? So they're offset. Right. It doesn't look like much, but the stretch is gonna be coming from this side, because he's twisting back upon this. It's actually coming from way back there to up here, right? That's a big exaggeration. It's just so you can see it. So let's see, this way would be the pinch, so we could come across like that. And then I would show the shoulder like that, and that shoulder like that. Keep going. Does that make sense? His head be looking like a potato. His head be looking like a potato. Okay, so let's take all this away. And let's give it a good go for 3 minutes and 45 seconds. See what we can do. See what we can do freehand. So you 
get a hold of my tools a little quicker. So we got layer problems. There we go. What did we decide? We decided. Let's see in that. Right? I gotta land. If his chin is here, then I've got to land that at the pit of his neck. And his shoulder's pretty low. Okay, so how are you gonna shade this? Again, abstractly. Abstractly, we know how to shade a sphere. And if not, we've got an online school with those lessons all set up and ready to go. And that sphere is gonna cast a shadow on the neck. And next, I have a form shadow to right there. That cast shadow is going to go right to there. And that cast shadow is going to go over on that shoulder and down that side of the body. So one thing I'd like you to notice is there's a big stop on all of these. And when I say a stop, I mean a number four value creating a wall. Okay, so look at that. The shadow on the sphere Casting a shadow on the neck along with the cast shot, uh, I mean the form shadow of the neck, then casting a shadow across the shoulders and the chest, and then you have the form shadow of the chest or the arm. So all of those shadows, right? So there's, and this would be there, and then we line them up with the cast shadows, and guess what? you have one big single shape that's gonna carry. Okay, so I hope you guys can see that and learn to see that. Oh, did I do all, do bad layers, bad layers. <laughs> tap, 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 okay, tap, tap. and then we got one minute, so how could we go through? Where is that eye? Whoops. Don't do it, do it with that color. Don't do it with that color. Where's that eye socket? We'll get the pinch of that nose. Right, so that's a big change on the face. The nose is a big change. Topograph topographical change. Show the form. Get that sexy mustache on there. Get that sexy, sexy mustache. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> so Linda from Bob's Burgers, if you guys don't know. That's not going to help. Okay. Better. We'll keep more respect if they don't know who, what we're referring to. <laughs> 15 There seconds. we go. Okay, ears here, and then the hair will go on top of it. So you guys see how quick it'll come along if you get the big pieces in and then those little pieces, get them right and bang, you got it. How we doing is, what number are we on? We're on three and we're five minutes over. We're five minutes over already? Oh my goodness. Five. Will they ever forgive us? No. Okay. All right, well let's put this up. Let's start our five minutes and let's go. There you go. Okay, do I need to show you? We'll do it quick, but we're gonna start this side versus that side. We got the base of the chin, we got the pit of the neck. Go in here. So that's what we got. You guys see that? I hope you guys can see how, let me take these. So these were my big guidelines to begin with. You see how clear that really is? And it'll be even clearer once you, you know, even just the nose. And if you get a brow ridge across there too, it makes all kinds of sense. And then if we're, 
good enough to start getting our proportions right, it'll even make more sense. All right, so let's go at this. Three and a half minutes. That's plenty of time. Plenty of time. Okay, so we've got something like that stretched up higher. The nose. Mouth like that down shadow shadow that again abstractly I'm not trying to copy the photograph I'm just trying to think okay how would this work All right how am I going to express that then this collar we're seeing the inside of it, which is shadow side, which is nice because that highlights that white um, white shirt, right? Wrong. You say what right too much. Wrong. False information. The information is good. The delivery, uh, that word needs to be eliminated. Eliminated or reconstructed? Eliminated from my vocal presentations. It is overused. It's going to be banished. Banished to the use less bin. <laughs> yeah? Yeah? Maybe? It sounds like a toy in kindergarten when they like put it in like those bins like you used a lot, not used a lot. Hey, it works. It works, it works. Grandma has to scoot. Bye, Mom. Oh, Grandma. Don't go. Don't go. Don't go. <laughs> Just kidding. Bye. Have Doggy a good night. Dinner. Oh, yeah. Doggy duty. Oops, that's not what I meant. <laughs> Never mind. Have a good night. Goodbye. I'm not helping things. I'm not helping things. <laughs> a white shirt coming around, poking through. Boom. That white will have to go. Or that. Black, I'd have to go back over that because that's too big of a white. Where's the corner? Highlights go on the corners. Whoop. Try to fix that skeleton nose I gave him. There we go. What's your sigh for? Sigh? You sighed. I sighed. Yeah, is that a way of life for you now or what? Yeah. Mm, okay. Cool. Bet, bro. What? Nothing. I was quoting something my friend said today. Why would your friends say things during the day? That makes no sense. I know. It's weird. Uh, 50 seconds. I ain't worried about it. I know you ain't worried about it, but it's nice to have a heads up. You know, I ain't mad at you. Like when someone's leaving a text conversation, it's nice to say, got to go, instead of just not responding for the next hour and a half. Hmm. Sounds like you're having issues with your friends. Is that what's going on here? No. Oh. I was nearly stating a point. Nearly stating a point. Well, aren't you supposed to pin points and state facts? Mm. Huh? Mm. You don't know? Maybe they do. Okay. All right. So did you draw this guy as cool as he actually is? Let me get that cool jacket hanging out there. There we go. Yeah. Give this guy a little style. Hey, 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 we're styling the guy. We're styling the guy. Come on. Oof. That time. Time waits for no man. Or drawer. Mm. Okay, so that was three minutes. So we got one more? Yep. yep. Okay. One more. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Start to a big week. So our new session will start tomorrow morning if you're interested. And um, joining us, we're going to have two, uh, two sections, an 815 class and a 945 class. And uh, this is going to be, we're going to start with the fundamentals and do good. So what do we have? I have a pit of the neck. I have a chin. And it looks like there's a stretch here, but look, she's bending towards this shoulder, which means there's going to be a pinch here. So I would represent this like that. Uh, 
All right, and you can come back and how'd I do? How'd I do? Should we put the nose in? Should we put the brow ridge in? Pinch it out a little bit so we can see what is happening. I mean, what else do you need? What else do you need? You can decide whether to marry or not right from there. Oh, you don't need that. Timer. Are you looking for a timer? Why are you trying to make me nervous? It ain't working, yo. I'm not trying to make you nervous. You didn't start it. <laughs> didn't start You didn't start it. Okay. How come I got to do everything around here? You put it over there. How come I'm the one who had to put it out? Because you couldn't find it, and I went to look in another spot. Oh, don't even. Now you're reaching. Now you're reaching. Now you're just making it up as we go. Okay. And I like creativity, but in the right places. Mm. Mm. All right, here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. What did we say? We decided we were going to be something like this. Boom. So that means this is shadowed. Cast shadow, form shadow. That means this comes from we're way back here. This is going to go down, over, and that shoulder is going to be about here. This shoulder is going to be down from that, like that. We're going to cast a shadow. Let's see up for the nose. Right, notice I'm not drawing the eyes. I'm drawing the cavities where the eyes will go, right? Or the space where the eyes belong. Wow, that's deep. It's so deep, yo. <laughs> so deep. Bring a life jacket. No. Safety first. I know how to swim. In the deep end? Yep. In my deep end? Mm-hmm. Okay. Some big words. Plus, if I start to drown, I'll pull you in, too. Oof. <laughs> I'm glad this is just a short stage is it of your life. Um, is yeah. it? Yeah. <laughs> Susan keeps telling me you're going to be okay, and I keep saying, Susan, you don't <laughs> understand. You don't understand. This girl. This girl. Oof. I'm and she goes, no, you've got you to gotta be patient. She's still in there. She still loves you. I said, she's a monster, Susan. A monster. That's, I'm kidding, guys. You guys should know I'm kidding. Izzy knows I'm kidding. Do I? No, you know. Huh? I know you are. Oh, oh, I thought you were asking if I cared. Ooh! I he could. lands another <laughs> one. He lands another one. Have fun. Uh, you gotta up your game. You can't just walk off. Right? You don't, you're getting out scored. You can't walk off the course. You gotta wait for the timer, man. Gotta wait for the timer. You're the one that opened it up, so challenging. I said I was I was going to survive, and you brought in that Susan was saying she's good or not fine. You were saying she's a monster. Then I said I was kidding, and then you said, "Did I care?" No. And so it just. Okay, how did you remember every word I say when you spend so much <laughs> of our time not hearing anything <laughs> that we say directly to your face? Would you like to explain that phenomenon to me? When it's hmm? interesting, I listen. When it's interesting, you listen. <laughs> oh. uh, so when you thought you were going to have a little gunpowder for later, you were like, you were like, store that stuff. Store that stuff. Yeah, there's something in your neck. Oof. There you go. Was it knowledge? No. Was it love? No. What was it? I don't know. It was like a piece of something. I don't know. A piece of something? Mm-hmm. A piece of my heart that you ripped off? Yep. Oof. And I just threw it away. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. Take that one in. All right, so I know we're over um, because I didn't start this till late, but I hope you guys got a sense for this. And once you get it, it becomes a lot fun. You're not trying to copy, but you're really trying to solve a problem. And then you hit or you miss, but then with more experience and more experience, you get better and better and better. Okay, how did everybody do tonight? I did great. You did great? Yep. You can see you haven't. Okay, you did do great. We were glad you were able to join us. All right, what's that? I was just saying, in case there's any comments, we've got the school thing up there. Okay, so Mar new March session starts tomorrow. Not too late to s 
not too late to sign up. Wow. And there's a free preview course on our new online school. So make sure you check that out. You can always get to it at oh. jasonmeyer.com as well as the reference images for this week. That picture, man. All right, that was fun. Which picture? The one of me in the chess tournament. So cute. That's cute. My profile picture. Oh, the cringy. profile pics. I got you. I got you. All right. Cringy. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Shakti. You're so glad you were able to make it. Like I said, there's no rewind tonight because we did it live on air. Seat of our pants. Why we told jokes. Oh, look, there's five minutes up. Boom. Yep. The Boom. show has been canceled. Susan, Tom, Deb, Claudia. De Deb was here. Hey, Deb, I missed you. I was busy. Oh, pouty mouth off. <laughs> I thought you were saying potty mouth. I was going, wait a minute, what slipped out? <laughs> what slipped out? All right, Claudia, she doesn't need any encouragement. You don't need any encouragement. I do. Not even if you're going to pay for it, she doesn't need any encouragement. All right. All right, thank you, everybody. Thanks, Susan, for joining us. Thanks, my co-host, Miss Isabella Meyer and the beautiful Miss Cindy Meyer, keeping us all in track back there. We appreciate it, and we hope to see lots of you tomorrow morning. Class A, Section A, is 8.15 in the morning on Zoom through the school under our live. And then Class B will start at 9.45, 9.45 uh, through the live section. And I just sent an email with detailed instructions to all of the students. I told you guys she was awesome, so she said she just sent out an email. Any questions, let us know. If not... We will be back in the morning. Bye, guys. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye. Love you guys. Thank you.